Do you know, we humans have mapped 100% of the moons and Mars, but 95% of our own oceans remain unmapped. Hidden beneath the waves lies critical information locked away in complex files only experts can access. Flowchart is here to change that. With AI, we can make ocean data simple and accessible for everyone. So anyone can ask, explore and help protect our planet's blue heart. In simple words, Flowchart gives the ocean a voice, building hope for a more sustainable future. Our solution is an end-to-end -end pipeline that processes Argo net CDF data, storing it in Oatkey's SQL for structured query and vector database for semantic search. A backend powered by a large language model converts neural language questions into queries and delivers context-aware answers. On front-end, we provide interactive geospatial visualization summaries and a chat interface to guide users. For a proof of concept, we are focusing on Indian Ocean Argo data, but the system is designed to scale to other satellite data sets as well. Our technical stack is designed to balance fast prototyping with scalability. We are using Python with Pandas, X-Ray, and NetCDF4 for data processing and fast API for a lightweight backend. PostgreSQL with PostgIS handles geospatial queries, while FAISS or Chroma supports vector search with Milbus if it's scale. Data is stored in an S3 compatible store as NetCDF and Paraquit. For AI, we start with GPT but can switch to open weight models if needed. Visualizations come through Streamlit or Dash with Plotly, Leaflet or Cesium. Everything is containerized with Docker using Compose for POC and Kubernetes for production. This setup gives us rapid prototyping now and scalability later. Our project is feasible because Argo provides high quality open data and tools like ArgoVis already prove uh, interactive exploration is possible. Using RAG architecture makes the system more accurate, flexible and scalable without retraining. The main risks are complex data handling, cost latency and LLM errors. But we address them with robust ETL design, efficient retrieval, SQL checks, testing and secure modular backend. So overall, the idea is both feasible and viable for real world use. Moving on to impact and benefits, our project makes ocean and climate data easier for everyone to use. With natural language policy makers, educators and even the public can explore Argo data in a simple way. It helps us understand big challenges like ocean warming, rising sea levels and changes deep in the ocean, supporting one Argo vision. By making the data accessible through AI conversations, we can inspire more environmental awareness and sustainable action. It also provides faster insights for industries like shipping, energy, and agriculture where quick access to climate data is crucial. And most importantly, it supports environmental stewardship, helping us detect climate-driven ocean changes in a much earlier and way, and we can act proactively. To conclude our presentation, I take you through the research and references that support our work. We rely on the Argo Global Data Repository and Indian Argo Project for the Ocean Data while Net CDF documentation for UNI data help us to handle multiple dimensional data set. We also study RGA and LM to apply AI for more accurate data interpretation. Finally, we refer to Portly, Lipids and CISM to design interactive 2D and 3D visualization. Together, these references form the foundation of our project. This concludes our presentation. Thank you for the attention.